today, the most simple magnet motor in the world. What you need is nailed in your magnet, some sort of screw, you should put it, you should put it in the center so that it is well balanced. You need one screw, you will put it just here, okay, this way, also put it in the center so that it is well balanced. And you need simple battery, triple A battery. You just put this screw here in the battery. And then what you need is just very, very simple copper wire. It's very simple to construct it on the small board, you can construct it at home. Construct it at home. It's, it's, it's really very easy to do it. We just put this side, one side of the wire here, and the second side you put here. And here is the most simple magnet motor in the world. I will use for the presentation simple battery, neodymium magnet. It is very important that the magnet is neodymium so that it is operating well. Copper wire and two sort of screw, plastic screw and an iron screw. Let's start to make the presentation first with the plastic screw. Okay, so we will put the battery on neodymium magnet. It's important to make a small hole in the battery so that the copper wire is staying at the battery and not falling down. So I will just put this copper wire over this battery. I will put it in the middle of the battery and we can see how fast the motor can operate. Once again, you can see the operation is really very fast. So with the plastic screw, the operation is quite interesting and fast. Now we'll try what we'll do with this metal screw. I will use for stabilization our iron plate so that it is not falling down because this is quite heavy. So we'll see whether this engine can work also with such a big and quite heavy screw. So we'll put it here and we can see the rotation is starting quite slowly, but finally the engine is quite well working. So it is quite powerful and can work quite strongly and fastly. How to use simple ice, okay, simple ice cube as a free energy generator for this steering engine. This is a very simple steering engine. You can see when I start the engine without ice, it's not working, it's not operating, okay. It operates based on, okay, its operation is based on difference of temperature between this downside and this upper side of the engine. So the difference of temperature is causing the rotation. So let's try the experiment. I will put this steering engine on the ice, okay. It takes maybe 10 seconds until the, the downside of the engine gets colder. And now let's try what will happen. Okay. You can see the rotation is already working. So only the ice and the cold temperature from downside is enough for the rotation of this simple steering engine. In maybe 30 seconds the rotation will even improve, it will go even faster uh, because this downside will get colder and colder. So, this engine is really interesting, the operation is quite interesting you can see how it works okay this is a simple presentation how to use the ice as free energy for this steering engine ice can be you can get ice everywhere outside when it's cold outside so it's quite for free okay this is all for today